Hi. Sarah? Hi, it's me, Jim. Oh my god, Jim! Jim, wow! <laughs> you look great. And you look so... different. Oh shit, I'm... Oh, it's okay. No yeah. worries. Totally fine. So, Chili's, this was a fun idea. <laughs> Is it alright? Oh, yeah. I would bring the kids all the time back in Trenton. Um, so, anyway, Julie said that she ran into you at a Starbucks downtown um, near her office. Do you work nearby? Yeah, I do. Oh, great. So, where do you work? Oh, maybe Julia didn't. I work at Starbucks. You do? Yep, I'm a barista. Oh, okay. Sorry, actually. Oh, could you excuse me for just one minute? I, there's a call that I, I just have to make really quick. Oh, no, it's fine. I'll order some appetizers. Awesome. Thanks. Just, just one minute. Barry, 30 years old. Came in last night due to the pile of eating off the island. Head injuries. Cracked the seventh and eighth rib, resulting in pulmonary contusions. Um, any responsive service on us? Yeah, I think it took a little too long to get to her. Doctor, the authorities are insisting on immediate evacuation now. We need to get going. Most of their wings have been vacated. Okay, we'll be right there. This storm's gonna be a bad one. She come here with anyone? No. She has ID. She's a nurse in school. Get out. Could have used the help. Tell me about it. I'll never know. Would have been a good one. New York, be with Hannah. Her father is going to let you stay there? Uh, I hope so. Hannah is an oncoming. When will you be back? Oh no. Stepping off that one train, I followed the crowds of people through what felt like never ending rat tunnels. Fighting to climb the greasy steps to sights when it's seen a million times in movies and TV. I, I remember a shoe repair shop was wedged in the corner. And there was this old man polishing shoes and he just looked up at me and smiled. My hand trembled on the cold yellow rail as I slowly ascended the final flight of steps. It was completely, completely unaware of the people who were suddenly using their purses and packages to shove me out of the way. I, <laughs> I didn't care. I was reveling in a feeling that I had longed to feel since childhood. This, uh, this feeling of freedom. And stepping out of that dark, disgusting tunnel, I was stepping into a new world of glitter and lights. <laughs>